Hi, Dr. Dan Forster here. It's really cold out here. I'm in Reykjavik, Iceland. Came here for a big medical conference. Had to speak. Going out to look at a fish oil factory here in a little while. Right now I'm at the city hall in Reykjavik and uh, they have a lot of zinc in the metals around here to, to keep them from rusting and freezing and, and other things. Zinc is a big problem, especially if you have pyrrole. It's a disorder, not really a disease. Pyrrole disorder means that you start, you start losing a lot of zinc, you pee it off due to creating these pyrroles that suck the zinc out of your body through your kidneys. It's a complex situation. You need to replace a lot of zinc in these patients. I have a lady and I'll show you how I give 700 milligrams of zinc a day to. And her serum level of zinc is still borderline low, but I just can't go any higher with her. And so we leave it at that. You also tend to replace the zinc with copper, which causes a copper toxicity issue. Thus symptoms of fibromyalgia, the first few cases I saw with that. And I realized there's some connection there. Anyway, my <laughs> everything on me is freezing out here. This is Dr. Dan Purser. Pyral disorder is kind of weird. It does happen. I disagree with doctors who say it doesn't. And it does cause serious low zinc levels. God bless and go in good health.